the next question is that uh, uh, what is the right way to pray for istighfar and also to do shukr as for istighfar there is what we call as salatu tawbah there is a hadith where the prophet says whoever commits a sin and then prays two rak'ah for the sake of allah azza wa allah will forgive his sins so normal two rak'ahs with the intention of seeking allah's forgiveness there is also what is known as sayyidul istighfar allahumma inta rabbi la ilaha illa ant khalaqtani wa ana 'abduka wa ala ahdika wa 'adika ma istata'ta a'udhu bika min sharri ma sana'ta abu'uka min ni'mati alayya wa bu'u bidhanbi faghfir li innahu al aghfiru dhunubi illa ant this is known as the master sayyid al istighfar of asking for forgiveness as for shukr there is nothing to be done except to be grateful with your heart with your tongue and with your actions allah says in the quran i'malu ala dawud shukra wa qalilun min ibadi ash-shukur o family of dawud work and strive in thanking allah azza wa jalla so what you do is a form of gratitude to allah azza wa jalla and seldom of my servants would be grateful so your prayer is a sign of gratitude your fasting your giving charity being kind to people overlooking their shortcomings obeying your parents connecting to your kinship um uh, protecting your tongue from slandering and cursing and saying bad things to people all of these are considered to be acts of shukr and expressing your gratitude as for praying two rak'ahs of shukr this is not authentic and in the hadith is not authentic so it's an innovation as for the prostration of shukr this is done only when a blessing happens not on a reoccurring blessing so if you get your paycheck every month you don't perform sujood al shukr because this is happening every month but if your wife cooks a good meal then <laughs> I was just shocked. Uh but if for example your uncle is in ICU and they say that he's very uh, dangerous and critical condition and you pray to Allah may Allah save him may Allah save him and then they say he's going into operation and it's very shaky and after 2 hours they say alhamdulillah he made it and you prostrate for shukr this is okay because this is not reoccurring and Allah knows best